Hello, I'm Pastor Dave, and this is our sermon recap for the sermon we had this past Saturday. Now, this sermon was based on the Gospel of John, chapter 1, verses 8 through 9, and 19 through 28. And this is a nice recount of the ministry of John in the preparation for Jesus beginning his active ministry. Now, when we look at John's ministry, John broke a lot of molds. He didn't exactly fit what was expected in that society or culture. And he ruffled some people's feathers. And that caused some problems, just like it would today. And it really comes into our expectations that we can fall into a habit that only certain people can do certain things. It comes up in our families and it comes up in our churches as well, where we have set expectations of how things should be done, how people should act. And any time the status quo is challenged, there's the opportunity for conflict. And this truly came about with John, because John went out to call the people back to God. Now, for some of the rulers at the time, they didn't see the need for that. They felt they were already with God, that they were doing what God expected them to do. And it was also a bit of the struggle with the people's expectations of who the Messiah would be. Because the problem they had with John was that he was called to do this work. He was called to prepare the way for Christ. And when people were looking at the Messiah, they expected a political leader or a military leader, not a religious leader, to call them to a restored relationship with God. And that was unexpected and, to a degree, unwanted by the people. And that set up John for a lot of conflict. And there's a lesson in there for us, because sometimes situations change and sometimes change needs to happen. We, it's an uncomfortable part of life, whether it's a, someone passed away or can no longer do something anymore, or simply what has always been done just doesn't work like it used to. Sometimes change is necessary, and sometimes change happens whether we want it or not. And it's also a reminder for us that the work of Isaiah and John continues to this day. Both called out to prepare the way for the Lord. And the Lord is coming back one day. The change is still needed. Preparing the way is still needed. So in the midst of change and turmoil, be prepared to make those changes, to make the way for our Lord. So that's our recap for this week. Now, since we're a week from Christmas Day, a reminder, Tuesday night, 7 p.m. is Blue Christmas here in the church. Saturday night at 6.30 is our praise service down in the Fellowship Hall. Sunday morning at 10.45, we will be in the sanctuary for the fourth Sunday of Advent service. And then Saturday night at, or Sunday night at 7 p.m. in the sanctuary, we will celebrate Christmas Eve. And we will be live streaming all the events on Sunday on the WSUMC Live Facebook page. But until next time, I'm Pastor Dave, and I truly hope to see you in worship this week.